Good morning everybody. It is March 18th and the time is 6.04 a.m. Um, I've been I've been sleeping fairly pretty good ever since uh, at night now when I listen to these CDs it's kind of hard to see in here. These CDs I'm gonna I'm just recommending to you guys anybody that's having uh, trouble sleeping audio Bible CDs they really do help to uh, rest better at night, sleep better at night. Um, I did have a uh, dream early this morning. I'm going to share it with you guys. I was trying to make heads or tails out of it, but um, with the other dreams that I've had so far, I'm going to say what this is. Um, we're getting ready to leave. People that are of the world, that live like the world, let me see if I can get some light over here. It ain't helping me much either way. Um, people that are of the world, that live of the world, yeah, I never really thought about this before, but uh, these are the people I've seen. I've seen like Elvis Presley in uh, this video, in my dream, you know, what I was seeing. And he had that smirk on his face where his one face, his one lip would lift up like, you know, like a, a half smile. And, uh, you know, those that live very worldly, well, anyhow, they were like in the back of my truck. And I was thinking, man, that's going to be hot back there, real hot. And then all of a sudden I had a... Uh, um, like a pyramid, like a cap with a pyramid, and it had a clock on it. Okay, like a timepiece, like a clock. And I went back and I hung it back there so that they could see it. And the time, it was something to do with a time period. And uh, I was going to try to get some air conditioning back there, and I heard the window just go click, like it shut, and I'm going, whoa. And I looked back there, I was thinking, this is going to get hot back there. And all of a sudden, it uh, looked like they started to get ready to do some um, weird things that I really didn't want to be watching, you know, perverted things like uh, a lot of like sex and stuff like that. And uh, the things, you know, like living like an abomination, like, we, like we're not supposed to be living. And I think that that pyramid that I seen with that clock was like a... Like, in other words, they're stuck back there, and they can't get out for a certain amount of time. And I think that's what that clock represented, a time uh, piece. Like, they're going to be there for a distance of time. And we're getting ready to go, you guys. I think we're getting ready to go. And uh, all these people, a lot of these spirits that have been... Uh, Hosting people that you see around here that and the orbs flying around and stuff a lot of these spirits Probably at one time or another hosted a lot of these people that are dead now That were very worldly that sought what they could find what the world would give them you know um, Yeah, you got to be careful what you what you're seeking in this world because um, you may not be, uh, the devil might be giving you what you want. That's what it comes down to. And a lot of these spirits that are in people, that's why I say, if we're not following Jesus Christ, who are we following? The world. You know, everybody's going in the same direction. And I've heard this said many times. Well, everybody else is doing it. This is what everybody's doing. You know? But yet in the word of God, it says, wide are the gates that lead to destruction. You know, and uh, this was what my dream was last night. Or the, early this morning, just before I woke up. It was very strange, I know. But uh, it's not that difficult to uh, understand it. The clock, well, the clock was like on a pyramid, you know. And I stuck that on the on the back part of the uh, sliding window on my truck. And it was like they they couldn't get out. They were there. They were kind of like stuck in there. And uh, that 
clock, I think, represented a certain amount of time, like maybe the 1,000 years that they're going to be held captive until they uh, are released again. And um, these are the people that lived like Elvis Presley, uh, Hollywood stars, people that were very worldly, you know, better than... Um, that's the best way that I can describe it, you guys. Um, I hope and pray that you guys get something out of that message. Uh, but that's all I got. That's all I got last night, man. And uh, I just wanted to share that with you first thing this morning. I know it's kind of dark, hard to see. But while it was still real fresh in my mind, I wanted to make sure I could share that with you. Um, God bless you guys. I hope and pray that you get something out of that.